Hi everyone, my name is Jamie Hendricks and I'm the facilitator for CUPS at the Unitarian Universalist Church of Tampa. Today's auction feature, we have basket number 1001. This is the Stitcher's Delight basket. Again, basket number 1001, Stitcher's Delight. All right, there is so much stuff in this basket. Now, most of this was donated by Joyce Formiga. There's a few items in here from Margaret Shepard. And then there's some stuff from me too. All right, so let's look at what we have in this awesome basket. Okay, so first of all, we have this really cute little travel iron. I've got the cord all wrapped around this thing. Let me get around. So it's got this like ridiculously long cord, people, which is really kind of cool because a lot of travel irons come with a stupid short cord. So this is a great item if you are a quilter or a sewer. Lord, cord never ends. Um, if you're a quilter or a sewer and you're taking a class somewhere, this is an awesome little iron to have. It gets super, super hot. Um, if you look at the plate, you can see it's completely clean. Like there's no rust, there's nothing on there. And that's because I never put water in it. Um, but it works awesome. I just happened to get a different model. So that's why I'm, I'm putting this one in the auction. It works great. It gets, like I said, it gets extremely hot. You do have a variable temperature setting right here. You can put water in it if you want. It does make steam. Um, you just put water in right there. Um, however, like I said, I, I never did. So that's why the plate is nice and clean. Um, so it works awesome. We also have some fabric scraps in here. So there's a beautiful purple with gold. And it's actually angels. I don't know if you can kind of see the pattern or not, but there's little angels in it. And again, these are fabric scraps, okay? We're not talking significant yardage here. There's some uh, tulle with gold stars, which is really pretty. There's a pretty piece of purple, white purple. Those are in there. There's also, let me get in here. We've got a little scrap of light blue. Um, and then there's a bunch of felt. This is another fabric scrap. It's really pretty. And then there's a bunch of different felt. We've got blue stars. And different colors felt. Do, 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 do. Squares. There's black felt, green felt, and then a bunch of white felt. There's some doilies. These are, um, these are nine inches. The package says 100 count. There are not 100 in here. Obviously, some of them have been used. Um, but these are like a tool and they're kind of a floral edge, um, lady edge. This is a really cool panel. And I put a picture of this in the item description. Um, see if I can get part of it in there. I got my hands all crossed up. Let's try this again. Round the camera. Do to do. So you can kind of see it's got all these different words about sisters and being blend blessings of sisters and things like that. It's really, really cool. So you could actually cut that up into all different things um, if you wanted to cut up the different sayings. Um, and I took a good shot of that and put it on the website with the item description. Okay. Then let's get into all the 8 million patterns that are in here, guys. So there's a bunch of these are little um, iron-on patches and things. And there's a whole baggie full of them in here. So you can, like, take your time and go through them and really see what everything is in here. But there's Winnie the Pooh. There's tennis, rainbows, all different things. Again, they're iron-on applique patches. So we've got a whole baggie full of that. There's a cute little sewing kit. So I always carry one of these when I go to ritual. This is one of those things that you never want to kind of be without because um, this is my ritual rescue kit. So when somebody has a dress tear or something, we can immediately fix it. There's a bunch of trim in here. So we've got all kinds of fuzzy, fun trim and some silk cording. This is actually really pretty um, beading cord. Okay. We also have a ton of patterns. Oh, more fabric. See, this basket just keeps giving and these are little kitties. It's so cute. We've got several of these, um, that are no sew applique iron-ons. Like this one is, um, it says cabbage, large Dutch cabbage. And then this one's a floral one. So this is really nice for people who just want to like dress up a sweatshirt or a bag, like a tote bag. It's really simple. It's no so applique. You just iron it on. Easy peasy. Um, but it's a really neat way to kind of dress up something that's really simple. And then there's a bunch more of them in here. There's another floral one. There's one that's a bass. Um, this is another iron on transfer. This is really cute. Look at this. This is Susie Zoo. Isn't it adorable? Um, there's also cross stitch patterns in here. 
So this is pattern only, but you get the little flowers. Cows. Good neighbors need no fences. And cute little bunny. So those are all in here. This is another iron-on transfer. So you can do the iron-on transfer kit. Um, so that will actually iron the pattern onto whatever you're gonna actually do the stitching on. And then here's all the thread and everything for the stitching. So you iron the pattern onto it and then you can go and do the stitching and do the embroidery by hand. Okay, there's also a pattern in here that's the McCall's craft pattern with bunnies, which is adorable. Again, more iron-on transfer, really cute, delicate little um, lace on the on there. This is a, um, an actual kit, um, so these are cute little ornaments that you can make. Um, you can make them as brooches, or you could hang them as ornaments. And one of them is actually included in here along with the thread and the fabric to do it, the Frosted fabric. This is another one. You get the pattern, and actually this is a full kit. You get everything in that one. Bookmarks, again, full kit. This is a iron-on transfer, so it's a little sun, if you can see it there on the patterns. Um, this is an, more iron-on transfers, and this one actually comes with the pencil that comes with it. It's never been used. And again, so iron on, more iron-on transfers. And you can kind of see it's country designs. They're really adorable. Again, really neat way to, to dress something up. There's also some um, iron-on transfers for dolls. Those are in here. Again, another iron-on transfer. And then we come to the books. So there's a bunch of books in here as well. So there's a quilt series in here. And these are all by the same lady. So let's start with 101. We got 101, 201, 301, 401. This is actually a really good way if you ever want to learn to quilt. Um, she actually puts out an amazing series. This is by Sharon Hilgren. And this is the basics. So you learn how actually, not only are you learning the basics, like in how to actually cut the fabric right to make these quilts, you're actually making quilts in the pro in the process. So you don't end up with like a bunch of squares left over. You actually learn how to make quilts as you're learning your basics. And then beyond the basics, you learn again, more types of squares, but you're again, making quilts in the process. Exploring new shapes, that's her 301. And her 401, which is 60 degrees with no math. Okay, so, I mean, I'm disappointed because I love math, but I know a lot of people don't. So this is how to get your 60 degree angles and make things like your hexagons without having to actually do the math of making the 60 degree angle, which is pretty cool. Okay, we've also got the Strip, Trip, and Shadow Quilts for People Who Don't Have Time to Quilt by Marty Michelle. Anything by Marty Michelle is gonna be absolutely amazing. She's also got some really cool products on the market. We have watercolor quilts. These are absolutely freaking gorgeous. Oh my God. We also have, now this is a nice hardbound book. Um, Patchwork Quilts Made Easy. We have strip quilts in a hurry. I've made some of these. These go together really, really fast and they look beautiful. Color wash quilts, these are gorgeous. I never got a chance to do these, They're um, but they're absolutely beautiful and it gives you the full patterns and everything in it. And then, Fun with Fat Quarters. These are just really fun, quick projects that you can do. Um, again, great book series that's out there. So, all right guys, that's your Stitcher's Delight fat, um, basket. Again, it's got a ton of stuff in it. Great for anybody who likes to sew and craft. Thank you for watching and thank you for supporting the church.